Oh, god damn it. Might be able to hear the music as well. So, <laughs> we're here. We are here and we are going to be playing uh, some Minecraft because reasons. Because we can. Because I can. And uh, we're recording an episode of Creative Corner. So, uh, if you've never seen that show before, uh, that is on the Gamecast YouTube channel. It is a show where we may, or you know, I make a thing in a creative game, usually with some sort of challenge. This time, the challenge has been set to me by uh, Sully in uh, in Gamecast. <laughs> he's, he's, he's the owner of Gamecast, actually. So anyway, he, he set me the challenge, and I'm going to be building a taco in Minecraft because of um, because Alex likes tacos a lot, and we are in the Minecraft, and I literally cannot remember what I'm doing. It's been a very, very long time since I've played this game, so let's think about this a little bit, and I think, yes, a taco shouldn't be too difficult to build like this.
couple of bits hanging up there on the top. So, that is our taco. Nice. I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> Some people use Minecraft to create the entire world of Westeros to scale. Well, I just saw someone build a giant taco. You're damn fucking right you just did. And guess what? It looks delicious. <laughs> there we go. I've wasted, what? half an hour of people's time making a taco in Minecraft. Why the fuck not? That, what I'm going to do, just some behind the scenes stuff. I'm going to wrap up the episode of Creative Corner like this now, and then I'm going to uh, just make another thing and do another intro. You know, that's fine. So there is my taco. That took me about half an hour, just under. Not too shabby. I've got uh, layers of Beef at the bottom. Bits hanging out looks quite nice. Bit of lettuce. A bit of cheese that I made with some sponge. Good spongy, spongy cheese. Yeah, spongy cheese. And some tomato that is made out of wool. Mind you, the taco is made out of wool as well. So, yeah. It's, it's probably wouldn't taste nice. But at the same time... As someone who doesn't play Minecraft very often, I'm pretty happy with what I've made there. And that's the end of Creative Corner, and I will see you next time for more bullshit like this.